When performing the barbell back squat, one quarter reps at the bottom, the first thing you need to take into consideration is the way that the J-cups are facing. You want to be facing the J-cups for the reason of, once you complete your squats, it's as simple as come forward, on, and relax. As opposed to facing away from the J-cups, if you come up, over, squat, as you come back and you miss the J-cups, you go back, back, down, 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 you end up arching your back, you're going to be putting yourself at a massive risk of an injury, okay? And that's what we want to be minimalising. Second of all, if you've got sponsors, use them, okay? Let's say you're at your eighth rep at 50 kilogram squat, and you're not 100% certain, but you want to go for it, like so. Eighth rep, you set yourself up, you come down, you try to drive up, you fail, then you simply drop the bar onto the spotters, walk out, relax. Again, you're nice and safe, minimalizing any risk of an injury. So, put the bar back up. Go and complete a barbell back squat, one and a quarter reps at the bottom. First of all, set your hands, step underneath. The bar should go along the shoulders and traps, but not on the neck. Bar comes up, step back, set your feet. A little bit wider than hip width, make sure the weight's in your heel, big toe knuckle, little toe knuckle. And from there, you're going to breathe in, so you come down. At the bottom, we're going to do a quarter rep and then go drive all the way up. Again, breathe in, pull yourself down, quarter rep at the bottom, drive up. So, the eccentric part of the lift is when you come down, so this is where we want slow, controlled movements. Down. And at the bottom, in this position, you want to drive your feet hard into the ground for the concentric part of the lift. So, eccentrically coming down, quarter rep, concentrically driving up. Last couple. Slowly down, quarter up at the bottom, drive. Last one. Big drive up, step forward, ball comes on, and relax.